probably once a month, uh, I see a patient who is thin and um, has no family history of diabetes and um, developed diabetes and um, nobody thought to check their pancreas. Um, we know that one of the earliest signs of pancreatic cancer is often new onset diabetes. So stressing with physicians and uh, primary caregivers that new onset diabetes um, ought to be evaluated as a potential sign of pancreatic cancer is, I think, a, a very important um, concept that we need to try to um, communicate to the primary care community. Uh, I saw a patient not long ago who was vacationing in Italy and uh, got sick and went to the hospital and was diagnosed with diabetes. And first thing the doctors in Italy did was put him in a CAT scanner saying, um, you might have pancreatic cancer, and lo and behold, he did. So not only do people with jaundice and abdominal pain and unexplained weight loss um, potentially have pancreatic cancer, but I think it's really important to communicate to the physician at large that new onset diabetes in somebody who doesn't have other risk factors ought to be considered a sign of pancreatic cancer until proven otherwise.